Okay, one way of providing resistance on your lower abs is to cross one foot over your knee, just like that, okay? Now the tightness of your glute muscle, the gluteus maximus, medius, and minimus, back behind your right hip is actually gonna provide a little resistance. Now when you do the same exercise, go down and tap your toe, this ankle, this right ankle, is actually pushing against the left knee, so it provides a lot of resistance. These are very, very tough. You keep going until I'm done talking, okay? The, now, just like I mentioned before, when you're training obliques, uh, if, you have one, if you're training one side, you don't want to do the same side every day first. So some days you're going to train your left side first, some days you're going to keep going, train your right side first, uh, and alternate. You could do like five one way, five another way, back and forth, and slowly down. That's good, that's good. Do you feel those a little bit? Yeah. Don't forget to do the other side. And you can rest a little bit in between. That's a full set. You're going to go to the point of probably close to failure. Uh, so you want to take a break in between and uh, recover and then go ahead and, and do the other side. Do a, do a few just to check form. Now remember, if you keep your foot close to your body and only tap your toe, you're not going to use a hip flexor. If the foot comes away 